Welcome to Book Talk Thursday with Miss Diane. Today's book is The Replacement Wife by Darby Kane. The number one international best-selling author of Pretty Little Wife, which I loved, returns. Two women, gone, and no one seemed to care but her. It's too late. I think he's going to kill me. Add Darby Kane to your must-read list. Wendy Corsi Staub, author of The Butcher's Daughter. I have, Wendy. I have. This book got 3.57 stars from Goodreads, a domestic suspense novel that asks, how many wives and girlfriends should disappear before your family notices? Elisa Wright is a mom and wife living a nice, quiet life in a nice, quiet town. She's also convinced her brother-in-law is a murderer. Josh has one dead wife and one missing fiance. And though he grieved for them, he starts dating someone new. Elisa fears for that woman's safety, and she desperately wants to know what happened to her friend, Josh's missing fiance. Searching for clues means investigating her own family, and she doesn't like what she finds. A laptop filled with incriminating information. Other women. But when Elisa becomes friends with Josh's new girlfriend and starts to question things she thinks are true, Elisa wonders if the memories of a horrible incident a year ago have finally pushed her over the edge and Josh is really innocent. With so much at stake, Elisa fights off panic attacks and a strange illness. Is it a breakdown or something new? The race is on to get to the truth before another appearance disappearance because there's a killer in the family or is there i gave this book five stars i rarely ever give a book five stars i could not stop reading i was irritated if i had to stop for any reason i was always sitting on the very edge of my seat you have no idea what is going to happen next I raced to the very end. In fact, I was like, slow down, slow down, slow down. I read this book on the Libby app. The ebook is available there. Uh, the library does have the large print edition of this book on uh, pre-order, but it will not be available until May of this year. Thanks for listening, and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.